Well, a high school hockey player unexpectedly collapses and then died on the ice. I mean, Rafer Weigel, did they know? Did he have a past history of medical they say problems? They say no, and I think that's one of the reasons why this is so shocking. We have no idea why this wow. happened, the particular of these kids. Oh, I bet they'll do it justice. That's awesome. And they have to have a party to have both of those bands meet. They deserve a standing ovation. Yeah. I'm going to watch all new sports in the next that's half cool. hour. Thank you, Rafe. Uh, how's this for challenging conventional wisdom? Sex does not sell. That's the conclusion of a new study. Researchers looked at more than 900 movies. They say sex and nudity generally didn't impress fans or critics and didn't guarantee success at the box office. Now, one media expert says it could be because few things are shocking for today's generation. Isn't that sad? All righty, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Of course, that might depend on who lives next door to you. A real estate website asked which celebrities would make the best and worst neighbors. You could save thousands of dollars on the last ones on the lot. Jennifer Westhoven's been looking out for you on this one. I know there's a little bit of a catch we need to be aware of, right? Yes, there is. But it's still, I mean, to get a new car for half off. I know. That's pretty you can't amazing. can't beat it. Yeah, I mean, I know this isn't also, this isn't a great time for a lot of people to be buying a new car, too. So it's a... No, yes. no, no. He's been on the yes list for some people no, because no, no. they said it would just be pure entertainment. No, no, you'd have, you wouldn't get out of your driveway. Wow, well, that's... The media too. would be there constantly. I know, I know it. Um, speaking of sports, mm. since you mentioned Tiger Woods, a former top city official we're talking about wants to uh, force the Colts into giving fans their money back for Sunday's controversial game. I bet you didn't even see this coming. No, we are on Wednesday, and I cannot believe we are still talking, talking about, about this game. But the reason... <laughs> but, but wow. This is bizarre. A high school hockey player unexpectedly collapsed and died on the ice. And it's so bizarre, too, because there's no right. history of any medical difficulties. According to the coach, there's no history. It wasn't like he was overly exuding himself. This according to witnesses. So an autopsy. Wait to see how they they're do. They're going to knock it out of the park. I know it. I Good can't for wait them. to see And it. they're going to have a lot of support, too. People are going nuts over there. They're going to give him a standing O every yeah, time. That's great. Thank you, Rafe. Uh, drums have exposed a New Hampshire woman to a rare type of anthrax. Health officials say she may have swallowed spores at a drum circle gathering earlier this month. Now, they may have been on the drums' animal hide covering, I guess. Spores have been found on two drums and on an electrical outlet in the building where she was. So a state health official says this type of anthrax is found in nature. Uh, the guy with the so-called best job in the world is recovering from a potentially deadly jellyfish sting. You remember? Hey, happy hump day to you on a shortened work week, no less. It's even better, right? I'm Christy Paul in for Robin Mead. We're so glad to have you on board with us here. Let's check out.